The tech world is growing at god speed and one of the fastest growing industries of the tech world is definitely software as service industry. So it is obviously very hard to keep up with every change. Hi, this is Sarah from Music Guiding and today we are looking at the top SaaS businesses that you should be aware of in 2022. Let's get to it. First on our list is HubSpot, and if you haven't heard of it, you're missing out on a lot. HubSpot is one of the few uh, tools that is fully integrated. It has many hubs that customers can use to do content marketing, email marketing, analytics, and very different other things. So if you're looking for a solution that is going to give you just one location to control everything that's going on in your business, HubSpot is a great option and it is not very expensive to start with and the community uh, is great. So give it a try. Second on our list is Salesforce and it is basically uh, named the golden standard of SaaS. Uh, the most important thing that Salesforce does is its CRM, but it basically uh, offers very different solutions for all types of companies. The only problem is that Salesforce can be a little pricey with its user licenses, but it is a free trial. And if you want to give it a try, go ahead and give it a try because Salesforce is definitely uh, one of the biggest companies and it has integrations with basically every SaaS uh, tool out there. Number three on our list is Slack and Slack has basically been known as a game changer in the SaaS industry. Uh, what it did was not really replace emails but give businesses a better alternative to emails uh, rather than emailing each other back and forward businesses now can use Slack to easily communicate in and out of the company. You can basically uh, talk to your teammates or build projects outside and inside of your business. Uh, so it has been really great and the support at Slack is perfect. So if you're looking for a communication option, Slack is the one for you. Number four on our list is Dropbox and uh, everyone knows that Dropbox is one of the most commonly used file storing services out there. But what it did was basically it came up with the idea that everyone should be able to access their files and documents from anywhere they go and from any device. So basically Dropbox gave people, individuals and businesses the option to store uh, any file and it's very secure and encrypted you can just uh, store your tax returns or legal documents there so if you're looking for a solution like that dropbox is definitely the one for you number five on our list is user guiding and yes that is our platform and i'm proud to say that it's one of the best uh tools that you can use right now to uh, enhance your user experience, make sure you keep retention rates high, churn rates low, and what you can do basically with it is that you can create interactive guides, walkthroughs, uh, you can ask for feedback from your users, you can put resource centers in your tool, you can do basically anything to enhance the onboarding UX of your own product. Uh, and the best part is it is very easy to use and it is very affordable. Don't mind it that it's coming from me, I'm being honest. User guiding is the one for you if you're looking for a great digital adoption or user onboarding option. And number six, we have Proof Hub, which is a tool that really brings everything together. If I could, I would call it a super app. So it basically has a use case of project management and collaboration, but it also has different um, options like uh, performance tracking, in-app uh, messaging and everything. So if you're looking for an option that brings everything together and makes collaboration very easy for your team, Proof Up is the one for you and the best part is it has the very, very different and a great set of uh, languages so you can work with any team member in any country. 
And number seven, we have Donor Box, which is a fundraising tool that was created to help nonprofit organizations. Uh, what it does is help you easily because it has very simple uh, UI design. Uh, it helps you easily create and uh, manage ticket sales and charity donations and everything. And the best part is if you're a nonprofit organization, uh, bringing in money for charity. It's definitely uh, free to use for you. It's already free to use, but you don't have to pay any transaction fees or anything else if you're doing it for charity. And we thank DonorBox for that. At number eight, we have Google G Suite. And let's be honest, we're all using Google or some kind of service of it. So why not bring it all together and enjoy the integrations? Uh, basically what Google G Suite uh, offers is very different apps from calendar gmail uh, meet drive uh, to many other analytics slides everything basically that a business can need so if you're looking for a secure easy to use uh, suite of apps that your business easily can enjoy for free up to a limit Google G Suite is the one for you. And number nine, we have Zandesk, a uh, customer service hub that uh, lets its users bring together all the customer support, customer service data, and uh, basically streamline it all easily. Uh, from the tickets, the emails, the messages, it all comes together thanks to Zandesk. And it has been a very popular tool ever since it was launched so you know it is a reliable one especially if you are a small to medium-sized business Zendesk might be the best option for you for your customer service and support needs and number 10 we have DocuSign an uh, electronic signature app that helps your business stay secure what it does is that it securely locks down your documents so that they cannot be edited and obviously it has a two-factor authentication system so basically if you get DocuSign you get very secure business going on I definitely recommend it and number 11 we have Canva which is my very favorite creative tool uh, that can be used by any business or individual uh, what it does is that it lets you create designs from any uh, device anywhere uh, and it has a free version as well that lets you use up to a thousand free templates so it is definitely a great tool if you're looking for a way to create designs no matter the shape the size or the industry of your business. Cisco WebEx is our number 12 and it is a virtual collaboration tool that lets you collaborate with your teammates and other people from anywhere and any device. Uh, knowing that Cisco is a very big company as is, you know that you can trust their software. What it does is that it lets you uh, share files, edit documents together and even screen share. Uh, so if you're looking for a great uh, tool for collaboration coming from a great business, you got it with Cisco WebEx. At number 13, we have Buffer, which is a social media management platform that lets you schedule your posts, uh, analyze your social media presence, and do basically a lot more about your social media channels. Uh, it was designed with uh, busy entrepreneurs in mind. so. Basically, it is very easy to use and it helps you increase productivity, reduce stress, and make your social media channels look very professional. It has a free plan, but if you're looking into using the full functions of Buffer, you might want to pay up a little. At number 14, we have Shopify, a legendary e-commerce platform that lets you set up your e-commerce store in less than 30 minutes. It is very well known as being uh, a very easy to use and easy to manage uh, solution for e-commerce. So if you want to set up your own website uh, in e-commerce, it is going to take so little time 
it will give you a great amount of flexibility and design and whatever you want to change in the website and you're going to be at the trusted hands of Shopify a trusted uh, platform that's been around for years so I don't know a greater deal much like Shopify, at number 15 we have VIX, a tool that lets you create your very own website in under 30 minutes and requiring no code whatsoever. So whatever background you're coming from, it won't matter because VIX is a very easy to use platform for you to realize your website. Uh, so if you're looking to create a very basic website, there is a free plan that you can use with the basic functionalities of Fix, but there are other bigger plans that you can use. But what you gotta keep in mind is that Rix is just a beautiful, beautiful platform. Number 16, we have Crowdcast, which is a beautiful platform if you're looking into creating events on the go. Uh, it basically lets you create training sessions, online courses, Q and A's, whatever your event is, it can be ready in 60 seconds with Crowdcast. And the best part is it is very easy to use. You probably can concur that from the 60 seconds uh, F4 time. But Crowdcast is the solution you're looking for if you wanna create brand awareness or do whatever you wanna do in 60 seconds. Number 17, of course we have Zoom. Uh, it still holds its popularity and it still has its free plan. So whether you're an individual or a business, Zoom can be the solution you're looking for. It lets you uh, get in video calls from any device and it is just the go-to uh, solution for video conferencing. Now, come on, it's 2022, but it's still holding up and it's the solution you need. At number 18, we have Trello. At this point, it is a veteran platform and probably the reason why we love Kanban style project management so much these days. Uh, the selling point of Trello is, to be honest, it's simplicity. You can create and uh, assign tasks, whether it's a big project or very small tasks very easily uh, with its simplistic UI. So Trello is the solution you're looking for if you are working with employees that uh, don't need to be looking at very complex tasks and if you just, just love cabin style. At number 19, we have Adobe Spark, which is a platform that focuses on visual uh, creation. If you don't have the time or effort to go uh, to, into learning Photoshop or Illustrator, Adobe Spark is your go-to solution for creating marketing material or presentations or any kind of visual material that you want to use for your business. Uh, it definitely looks perfect uh, and it is sure to make your uh, visuals of your business pop. Uh, it has a free plan, but if you're looking into using more uh, core functionalities, you just might want to check out the uh, pricing. And number 20, we have Zapier, which is one of the most popular automation tools you can use today. Uh, if you're looking to very simply automate your workflows, uh, filter your emails, your social media platforms, do any sort of automation, Zapier is a one for you. The selling point is definitely that it is very easy to use. So if you're looking for a easy to use automation tool, Zapier is right there. At number 21, we have Quip, which is a great tool for document creation, management, and sharing. So if you're looking for a tool that will let you get rid of the email overload or pricey licenses for software that you don't need for document creation and uh, collaboration, Quip might be the solution you're looking for. And the best part is it was built for anyone, any business size, any person of any background. It is very easy to use and I mean it. Go give it a try. Do you enjoy micromanaging your employees? At number 22, we have Togo, which is a platform that lets you monitor uh, how long a task takes for an employee and basically lets you manage work hours and work efficiently. Uh, what it does is that it shows you what task takes 
longer than required or less than required so that you can uh, manage your workflows extra carefully and make sure that everyone is as productive as can be. So give Toggle a go if you're into that. And number 23, we have Rike, which is a project management platform that lets you uh, create and manage different tasks no matter the size or content. Uh, it is great because it lets you integrate with very different uh, tools and platforms like Google Drive and other uh, important productivity tools. Um, it lets you use Gantt charts and other types of uh, boards and charts. Uh, so with other very important features like uh, deadline tracking, uh, task management uh, and assignment uh, customization, Bright is a great tool if you're looking for a good project management platform. And number 24, we have Culture Amp, which is a uh, employee engagement and performance enhancement platform that basically focuses on improving your company culture by uh, having you access real-time insights of your employees and their performances. Uh, there are different features and functionalities like letting you see what employee uh, does what job better so you can create the perfect team. You can look into insights and feedback of employees. You just basically know what is going on in your company and how you can please your employees and customers beforehand. Uh, so Culture Amp is a great solution if you are looking for a solution like that. So that was all the software as a service tools we had for today. If you think we missed one, don't forget to put it in the comments. This was Sarah from User Guiding and see you another time.